Hey guys, it's Koshner Weekly, and I just wanted to thank you all for 100 subscribers and all the support you've been giving me recently. So I'm over here at Indiana Beach to film another triple loop construction update. So as you can see, the entire circuit is here except for the transfer track over there. But uh, it was topped off like uh, three days ago, I think. And as you can see, here it is. Um, one thing that I found kind of weird is they already put it all up, but they haven't painted all of it yet. So I guess they're going to do some painting when it's already up. Because it'd be kind of weird if they just left it like this with some random paint in some spots and paint in some other spots. But uh, as you can see, Steel Hog is also painted. It has a new shiny coat of paint. So that's nice. But um, I'm super excited to see that the whole thing is here. It looks really big from standing right here and seeing it. It is the new uh, tallest coaster in the park, actually. Um, pretty sure it's the fastest, too. Obviously, the most inverting. And um, I'm super excited for this to open. Um, we've got news that it's not going to open uh, on opening day. It's going to open, like, uh, in the middle of the season. Well, that's fine, because, you know, we want them we want to take as much time as they need to keep it uh, safe and all put together. And uh, you might be able to see it in the background if you look, but... Uh, I don't know if you can see from there, but the cyclone is also fully up. So yeah, they're getting some really good progress done. There's the new maintenance shed. And apparently there's going to be some other new rides coming to Indiana Beach soon. Uh, they bought a condor ride from the park they bought this one from. And uh, Indiana Beach's sister park also got a new Swarpscroft coaster from the old park in Mexico. So yeah, Dean Staples is doing really good things with the park, and uh, I'm excited to see this open. Anyways, uh, I just wanted to thank you all for 100 subscribers and all the support, and um, I'll see you guys next time on Coaster Nerd Weekly.